<clears throat> in this video, I'm going to be going over public key cert certificates. In cryptography, a public key certificate is also also known as a digital certificate or identity certificate. It is an electronic document used to prove the validity of a public key. The certificate includes information about the key, information about the identity of its owner, called the subject, uh, and the digital signature of an entity that has verified the certificate contents called the issuer. If the signature is valid and the software examining the certificate trusts the issuer, then it can use that key to communicate securely with the certificate subject. In email encryption, code signing, re-signature systems, and certificate subjects is typically a person or, an, or organization. However, in transport layer security, a, a, a certificate subject is typically a computer or other device, though TLS certificates may identify organizations or individuals in addition to their core role of identifying devices. TLS, sometimes called by its older name, Secure Sockets Layer, is notable for being part of HTTPS, a protocol for securely browsing the web. What the hell does all that mean? Man, Wikipedia has terrible, terrible explanations. So what does that, what does that, what does that actually, what does all that gobbledygook nonsense word salad jumbled up mess mean, right? A public key certificate is an electronic document. A certificate, a digital certificate, if you will, that certifies or attests to a certain fact, and that fact being that a public key lines up with a person. That's all. That's really it. Uh, it will have information like what is the public key, a digital signature verifying the public key, who owns the public key, who issued the certificate, when, uh, when or if the certificate ever expires. Why do public key certificates exist? Public key certificates exist for the sole purpose of providing a way to verify, uh, providing a way to verify, providing a way to verify, public key certificates exist for, for the sole purpose of providing a way to verify public keys and the person and the people that and public keys and who owns that public key. So in short, a public key certificate is a form of digital certificate whose first, last and only reason to exist is to verify a public key and supporting information of that public key. Right. It, it's 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 made and created so you can verify that John Doe actually owns this public key or that this public key is actually owned by John Doe. And the entire reason for a public key certificate, the entire reason it exists is to prevent, again, a form of man in the middle attack. Keep hearing that one, man in the middle attack. What is an example of a public key certificate? A good example of a public key certificate is a root certificate, which is a concept I will be going over eventually. And that's what a public key certificate is.